everyone, I'm Andrea. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be explaining to you guys how notary signing agents or loan signing agents or loan closers or loan clo processors, we go by so many different names, but the main two names are loan signing agent and notary signing agent, how we get paid. So let's get right into that. So, as a notary signing agent, we mainly get paid in two different ways. We get paid either through signing service business or direct client business. And before I get into the difference between the two, I want to actually um, provide a little bit information on how does the signing even come about, who reaches out to who, etc., etc. So, um, who creates the documents for the notary signing agent to actually conduct the signing? And that is either a title company or an escrow company or a loan officer. It's really all three of them, but it really depends on what kind of loan or what kind of real property that we're dealing with or real property documents, I should say, that we're dealing with. So it could be anyone. It could be an escrow officer, a title officer, a loan officer. Okay, so that's who creates the documents and an escrow or title officer will typically reach out to a, no, a notary signing agent or a signing service. Okay, now that we preface that, let's get into the difference between a signing service and a direct client. client. So let's get into a signing service. So a signing service really acts as a third party or a middleman, I should say. Okay, so how it works is an escrow officer or a title officer will create these documents and they will reach out to the signing service and say, hey, can you look for a notary that is typically close to the signer or borrower um, to conduct the signing that I have? And so the signing service, once the escrow officer contacts the signing service, the signing service will now then contact and find a notary to conduct the signing. The escrow officer will then offer the signing service, let's say for an example, $300 to find a notary to conduct the signing, okay? The, then the signing service will find a notary and offer, let's say, $150 to conduct that signing. And the notary signing agent has to print the documents. They have to travel to the signer and they have to conduct the signing. They have to notarize and then they have to drop the documents off to FedEx or UPS and they're getting paid $150 to do that. Now, you're probably wondering, well, where did the 150, the rest of the $150 go? That goes to the signing service simply because they provided that signing to the notary signing agent. Okay, that is signing service. Now, direct clients. A di working with direct clients means you're directly working with the escrow or title officer. So the, the escrow officer will reach out to the notary signing agent and say, hey, I have a signing um, close to you. Are you able to conduct it? The notary signing agent will say yes. And the escrow officer will say, okay, I'm offering you $300. The notary signing agent will say, okay, that's cool. And I'm pretty sure right now you're saying in your head that you definitely want to work with direct clients. Now I'm actually going to give you guys more and more detail the difference between working with a signing service and working with direct clients. So the number one thing that is the difference between the two is that a signing service actually takes a fee. Okay, well when you're working with direct they do not take a fee at all. Um, and recently I've noticed that signing services are taking a lot, a lot of money from the original payment. You can actually find the original payment that they were offered on the settlement statement when you go and conduct the signing. Um, I want to say most signing services are taking at least 50 to 70 percent of actually what they are being offered. The second difference between the two is that it actually saves you money if you go direct. For an example, it saves you money on gas. If you are working with a direct client, most uh, signings 
happen at the signer's home, but I want to say 20% of the signings actually happens in that title office. And so that means you do not have to travel to the signer and then travel to FedEx. Okay. You would just have to travel to the office and then travel back home. Okay. So that definitely saves you a lot of gas. Also, if you go direct, you do not have to print any pages. Um, rather, rather when you are working with the signing service, you do have to print um, a lot of documents and then you also have to provide a copy of those di documents to the signers So at least you're printing I want to say 500 pages while if you're direct you're not printing any so that saves you money um, Another difference between a signing service and direct and Working with direct business is that you get paid a lot quicker if you work with direct clients. I want to say when you work with signing services, minimum it's going to take 30 days in order for you to receive your payment. Rather when we are working with direct clients, it's going to take I want to say around minimum 14 days in order to get your payment. So, that is a main difference between the two. I've even had signing services that paid me like I want to say like I have to check notary gadget, but I remember seeing a signing service not paying me for like a whole year later. And I'm like, how did I not catch this? I'm, if you guys want to know the truth, I'm really bad at keeping track of who pays me and who doesn't pay me. And that's just my fault. I'm just really bad at that. The difference is you actually have a huge opportunity to get more business if you go direct simply because if you're walking into an escrow office and you're working with one escrow officer and you are doing an amazing job you're conducting yourself in a professional manner and you're getting signings on time and you're not messing up any signings another escrow officer is going to see that or your escrow officer is going to tell another escrow officer and they're going to say hey i want to use you know her as or him as a um notary signing agent the last difference between working direct and working with signing service is that it is a lot harder to work with direct clients unfortunately and it is simply because most direct clients or most escrow officers and title officers really want to work with um, their preferred notaries, notaries that they've been working with for months or years, or they rather work with signing services simply because they've built long-term relationships with the people who own the signing service and their preferred notary. I'm not going to say it's impossible because it's not impossible. You just definitely have to build relationships with your escrow officers and title officers and be genuine and show them your value. What can you offer them and why would they choose you to be your notary signing agent? Okay, well, that was it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. I'll put my social medias here on the screen. If you guys have any questions, leave them down in the comment section down below or feel free to message me on my social medias. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.